This is Dylan Sieverts doing check-in number eight. Time spent studying, about five hours. Um, videos watched, last time I left on off on um, chapter 15 um, N1. So I was able to watch N2, N3, N4, and N5. I haven't gotten to too many of the examples yet. I started on homework problem um, number two and finished up number one. Um, other efforts, I wasn't able to meet with my study group on Monday, but I will be there for probably 12 hours tomorrow, Wednesday. Um, and then summarizing the material that we learned in the N3 video, basically, gave example of the um, globe where you have basically your origin you have another point over here and that creates another axis um, and something can rotate around that axis um, which would be omega I believe from my understanding and then you can always also take a point along that axis and you're sol you can solve for how that changes relative to the velocity of the axis, um, which would be the x prime, y prime axis. Um, and then in N4, um, talked about um, how basically you can do it in component form or you can do it as a rigid body. Um, and yeah, I'm planning on finishing up the homework tomorrow on Wednesday and that is all.